Hey everybody, uh, driving to La Crosse, Wisconsin right now for a corporate gig that's happening tonight. Uh, you can see my ETA, I'm supposed to get there at around two. So we're right on track. This gig is with one of the bands I'm in called the C Notes. Um, I've vlogged before on a gig day with the C Notes. If you haven't seen that video, definitely go check it out. So it's, we're staying in La Crosse, Wisconsin overnight tonight. Uh, and then tomorrow I'm headed straight to Burnsville, Minnesota where one of the other bands I'm in called Mixed Up is playing tomorrow night. So yeah, it's a busy weekend. Lots of songs that I have to try to not screw up, but uh, yeah, it should be fun. You Midwesterners know. If you've never been to Culver's, you're missing out. I've had the in and outs I've had the Whataburgers, the steak and shakes of the world. This, this right here is the best fast food burger. 100%, no doubt about it. Alright, we made it. I'm just gonna go get a lay of the land here, figure out where I need to go, go to the bathroom, and then we'll get my drums loaded in and set up. We have about an hour, I think, until we wanna try to sound check, so should be just the right amount of time, I think. Hi. Hey. Yeah. Hey! Hey, how's it going? Oh, it's got a whole band. Yeah, almost. <laughs> Can I give you a hand? No, I'm good. I got a I got the, yeah, I got the new. Oh, thing. that's right. Yeah, you're so, using the club too. So please, so please don't help me. I want to use it. <laughs> so, I just got one of these rock and roller carts that expands. I used to just use this really cheap, like, flatbed, tiny cart I got at Menards. Save big money at Menards. But now, I got one of these. Because I'm a real musician. So here's the room we're in. It's kind of fun in here. It's honestly a little smaller than I expected, but I'll just have to play a little quieter than I want to, but I can do that. I'm mature. So everybody's finishing uh, plugging in their XLR cables and whatnot. I think we'll sound check here in a, in a moment. I know very little about the company that we're playing for. Or I don't know anything. I'm just here to play drums. set. Mics are sounding good. Mix is all the way dialed in the way we want it to be. Um, now we have a couple hours to kill so I'm gonna check into my hotel room. I think we're gonna have dinner and then it'll be showtime. Uh, Tsuchiya, T-S-U. Room number's at the bottom of the packet there. Great. And then this has your exit gate code for the parking Okay, code. awesome. Thank you very much. Of course. Hi, how's it going? Fine, thank you. Okay, not bad. It's about what I expected, I guess. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, pretty, uh, pretty basic stuff. I got a little bit of a view of downtown La Crosse. Uh, kind of obstructed by this ugly rooftop, but you know what? I'll take it. <clears throat> Alright, I'm 
in kind of our green room right now by myself. Uh, but yeah, we're just chilling. It's about 20 minutes before the gig. Uh, I'm feeling good. Corporate gigs can vary in terms of how fun and exciting they are, but they pay well. So yeah, we're just gonna have a good time, play some good music and uh, enjoy our night here in La Crosse, Wisconsin. I tear this all down, I want to give you a little rundown of what I'm working with here. Um, I have a little uh, Bob Kit Shelly Yamaha Stage Custom. I made a video about Shelly if you don't know the history behind Shelly. I have a Twin Cities Drum Collective Laser Shark Six Lug Maple Snare. I love it. It's purple. Really fun. Sounds amazing. Uh, Vic Fur Sticks. And I got a mix of uh, Zildjian cymbals here. Uh, look, there's Steve. Uh, some light stuff, some dark stuff. I like a little variety. Uh, just my personal preference. Uh, yeah, that's what we're rolling with. It's uh, done me well so far. Um, gig number one done over the weekend. On to number two tomorrow. Good morning, guys. Kind of have an awkward amount of time here. Look at 11 a.m. right now. I don't have to be in Burnsville at Buck Hill where our gig is until 6.30 p.m. And Burnsville is kind of on my way home from La Crosse. So I, I don't know that it makes sense for me to go all the way home and then come back this way to Burnsville. So I'm just gonna kind of bum it around La Crosse, I think, for a little bit. Maybe get some coffee and some food. And uh, yeah, just kind of see where the day takes me. Well, that was actually pretty enjoyable. Did a little bit of stimulating the lacrosse economy. Uh, hung out at a couple coffee shops, had some lunch. I got some video editing done, which is great. But yeah, it's cool here. Uh, it's a lot livelier than I was expecting it to be. I've been to lacrosse a couple of times, uh, but only for drum corps purposes. There's a drum corps show at the University of Wisconsin lacrosse campus, and I've been there. I performed there and I've been a spectator there. Uh, but yeah, I've never really hung out in the city. There's a lot of fun little shops and restaurants here. So uh, yeah, I'll have to I'll have to come back sometime. But now I gotta head to Burnsville for gig number two of the weekend. Made it. 
we're at Buck Hill. And if you can maybe see people skiing and snowboarding over there. Yeah, and I think the venue is in this building right here. Uh, so I'm gonna go in and figure out where I need to go. So we, there's a band that's kind of opening for us called the Northmen. They're friends of ours and we're gonna use, I'm gonna use his drum set that they have. Uh, it looks like a Pearl Export series, which is, you know, fine, but I'm still gonna bring up my snare, cymbals, and a uh, bass drum pedal, uh, just cause I, I'm picky about those things. gig is over. I'm loading up my car now. This is the worst part about doing all this is loading up after, but you gotta do it. Um, it was actually a good gig. Um, the crowd was small but fun and they actually, they kind of crowdsourced some money and begged the venue to have us play for another hour. So we did that. Uh, so I was pretty tired by the end there, but, uh, but we made it happen. Played some, some uh, songs that are deep in our repertoire that uh, didn't sound great, but they were drunk enough to where it didn't matter. <laughs> uh, so all the good day's work, gonna make the trek home now and, and go to bed. <laughs> Let's